A few days ago, I felt like a serious case of deja vu when I jumped on Twitter and found yet again Discord had been compromised. In case you hadn't heard, one of the popular bots, Me6, got hacked and it led to less than desirable experiences yet again for community members that were part of Discord. The more time I spend on Twitter, the more I see people feeling really, really fed up with Discord for a variety of reasons. And so that led me to spend a lot more time trying to find what alternatives are out there for people that want to provide that genuine connection and facilitate conversations in their community, but Discord is just not doing the job that it needs to be doing. I'm happy to say that I found some really great alternatives and I'll be sharing those in this video. Let's talk it's called Yuki. I actually had a call with the team and they took me through this community platform. It is a centralized platform. So if you're looking for something that is less hands-on in terms of setup, then Yuki could be the solution for you. It is a community platform specifically for Web3 creators. So it's great to see solutions like this being created. It's got plenty of Web3 integrations here. Uh, in terms of the UX, I think it looks a lot more beautiful than the typical kind of discords that a lot of people would be happy to get on board with. You've got here on the left, your menu. This to me looks really similar to Circle. If you're unfamiliar with Circle, I'm actually going to do a video about Circle. Um, it's mainly for Web2 communities, if I'm honest. Yeah, this whole vibe definitely gives me Circle vibes. Circle.so, I should say. This uh, platform, it has the, the menu on the left. You've got your content in the middle. Uh, you can gamify your community here as well. You can have them earn karma points. It's pretty simple in terms of the way that the community members earn these points. You can't customize that, but who knows, maybe the team will work on that in future because I personally would like to choose as a community manager how to how these community members could earn their points. But you can see important links are also included here and you can also see the members on the right. So it's just a really organized community platform, but the great news is it's specifically for Web3. So you do have more integrations than you would with the typical Web2 community platforms that are available for you. Um, you can organize events, you can collect payments, although I'm not sure whether the payments are in crypto. I'll have to find out and update you guys on that. Uh, but yeah, you can do everything through this platform. You can white label your community, which is great. Um, you can see here in the middle, you've got what they can do for NFT communities if you have one. So you can provide a specific home just for them, help them connect with each other and provide the ability to interact directly with you. They do have plenty of documentation here as well for you to get started. But one of the things that I would like to see more is documentation for those with NFT communities. I also want to see more information on how do you gate your communities? Is it truly Web3 gating? You are looking at this platform, then you definitely want to see more information around how do you do that and yet yeah, just to understand whether this is the right platform for you as i mentioned i did have a call with a team so so you can see here this is the platform uh, behind the scenes and i like to try to give people that are watching my channel the behind the scenes intel like what does the platform actually look like what does the admin dashboard look like what are you getting for your money? You can see that they do include their pricing as well on their website. You do have the option for a free version, but you also have the more pro options that start at around $79 a month. Uh, you also have the $249. And I think what's interesting is that you can have more than one community under the advance and a hundred mods or admins i would love to see that community that has a hundred admins so i feel like you need a community manager just 
to manage the admins, but you have unlimited storage here, greatly reduced transaction fees. And that's something to take note of when we're talking about these types of platforms. There are the potential for trans transaction fees on top of what you're paying. Be mindful of that, especially when you're looking at these centralized platform options. But again, what I think is interesting for something that says that they're for Web3 creators, I would be looking at, is there MetaMask integration? Is there all the different integrations that I would need to potentially token gate? And that's something that I couldn't see straight off the bat, but that's something that I would, would love to just see more Web3 applicable integrations.